Hello everybody, it's me and Hinstra, and today it's my turn, and I left the volume on in the other room, so get a nice echo effect. Um, by the way, today of course is the 25th of August, I'm sorry, July, wish it was August, um, it's not. Hello guys, it's Lemmy and Finished Trip, and of course, welcome back to another episode here on my channel. Me and Michelle spent a little time earlier doing another video. It was kind of more of a hangout kind of thing where kind of just kicking the tires on, having a good time. And um, that was pretty good, and I think it was very informative um, because Michelle. Uh, is going to be doing some experiments. Michelle received a huge uh, PayPal credit increase, which made it possible for her to buy the iPhone for as she wanted, and she was really excited about it. I must tell you that she also bought uh, a few other things as well. Some of it may seem uh, not quite as pertinent, and others uh, may seem a little bit silly um, but Michelle is a researcher and a person that who likes to experiment with new products um, we discussed it on her channel uh, so we're not going to repeat that here just to say is that uh, she spent um, close to about three hundred dollars out of the thousand dollar credit line increase uh, so Michelle should be watching her P's and Q's for the next few weeks because we might be needing that money for a lot more in the next few weeks. But one of those people don't, they don't people don't realize is when you get credit cards is even if you pay your credit cards on time and you're working on paying the principal off and they see that you're trying to pay at the principal, that's when they turn on the credit increases because they make more money on the interest than they do on the principal. It's, they realize that for most people, if there's more credit limit, you're gonna spend more money. And that's true with Michelle, that's true with almost everybody. Up until the sad reality that you get to a point where you can't pay the interest anymore. Hmm, sounds like the US, sounds like the US economy, huh? Well, I don't normally talk about business and money that's michelle's job my job is usually to talk about the spiritual realm and there's this this is very tempting um this is almost a kind of temptation that can um really really um destroy your well-being because you know we all need money somebody does you know and michelle is certainly not immune to the d desire for dollars and cents. As we've been going through in the last few weeks with the situation with the building, the landlord, the housing, the everything else, there's been the kind of the undercurrent in her heart that says, what if he doesn't get it fixed in time? What if I have to pay out $700 a month rent with no rental, assist no rental assistance, no roommate, no nothing? This is the kind of thing that can cause people, when they see a thousand dollar credit limit increase, to make bad decisions. It's because they're just printing off that they're, they see, oh, it's free increase. Well, hold on, Bucko, it ain't free. And second of all, 
is if you did not ask for that increase, then, which was the case of Michelle, she never asked for it, um, all of her credit cards are giving her increases right now. All of them. Capital One, First Premier, J.C. Penny, um, Dress Barn gave her a credit increase, um, and now Pay uh, now PayPal, and uh, so there's obviously it seems like there's almost like a conspiracy theory. It's not really a conspiracy at all. They see that Michelle is making payments on the to pay off the bills, and so they know that she's going to keep working on it. And now running up a huge tab. But they want her to run up a huge tab because that's how they make money. That's how they make money. Get Michelle to run up a huge tab. We'll give her unlimited resources. Well, it seems unlimited until you realize you blow it all. Then it's... You realize you just ran into the, sea, the reality ceiling that basically says there's no more money. When Michelle saw the increase, she was like the character Fry from Futurama when he said that he had several billion dollars in his checking account. I mean, she knew the money was not a gift, but she knew the money was just opportune time for her to finally get things done that she couldn't do for a long time. The iPhone was something she wanted. The iPhone was something she'd been wanting for years. So, yeah, it made sense that she'd jump at it. She didn't buy the violin yet. That doesn't mean she won't. In fact, I got the impression that when she, in um, October, when the Capital One credit increase comes in, and she's going to use that to buy her violin. I just got a feeling that's what she's going to do. Well, I mean, that's not, but I don't know. Michelle is, and I are completely separate. I don't know her agenda. Um, you might say, well, she's here now, right? She's here, but she's not here. In other words, She's in the wings, if you will, but she's not in getting involved in this video because this is my video. Just as I, she often invites me to be involved in hers. Double times she said to me nicely, sorry alone, but I need to do this one myself. So, you know, likewise, I usually do mine myself. I got 21 viewers on my channel. I really would like to see more. Come on, guys. What's so hard about being a common user on my channel? This is your chance to give me your own questions. I mean, I've been doing the Ask Us Anything questions with Michelle. The few of you that subscribe to my channel are also subscribed to her channel. I agree. I know that. But not everybody is. I'm sure there are a few of you that are not subscribe to both channels so the question is is if you're not subscribed to both channels what kinds of topics interest you come on i'm not gonna bite you just want to know what do you like to discuss um you know the door's always open i'm always just see michelle said too about her channels don't be afraid to ask these questions. Well, we'll answer them. If we can, if we can't, we can't, we can't. And uh, Michelle right now is editing the video down from our other session. She was having some problems with the Mac. Um, I don't know if she got the problem fixed yet. Um, I hope so. But I won't know until we check it. So, for now, I just want to say thank you for watching, and I hope that you, you know, I'm looking for your ideas, your suggestions, comments, concerns, what have you, and let's go to the next level. Let's create things. Okay? Bye-bye, everybody.